There are some familiar faces here at George M. Steinbrenner Field. Jorge Posada, Hideki Matsui, and Mariano Rivera, just to name a few. But for the most part, the faces are not so familiar. Shelley Duncan fell into the latter category last season, and I had a chance to reminisce about that with Shelley. First series up with the Yankees, he had three home runs and a multi-home run game at that. What was it like going in the dugout after that, those home runs and seeing the likes of Derek Cheater and Alex Rodriguez and sharing that with them? Uh, to tell you the truth, um, those, those three home runs, the whole weekend, it was... It was a little more simple for me because I was just trying to stay focused, slow myself down, and really put together good at bats to help out the team. And you know, when you do something, when you do something really that impacts the team and helps the team win a baseball game, it's special because you get to go in the dugout and you get to share that with everyone. Everyone's pumped up for you, and you're pumped up for everyone else. And you know, I think the funnest part isn't necessarily uh, Derek and Alex and those guys, but it's like Melky and Robbie. You know, the guys that I spent a lot of time with when we were younger because we got to do that same stuff down there. Right, the youth injection, which the Yankees are going with this year, and it seems to be working, especially, you know, you come in the dugout and you see you when, what, what you do after a home run. It just it, it makes the viewer, makes the fan go absolutely nuts the way you're going nuts in the dugout. And i got to tell you, it, it's welcome. I mean, it's a welcome addition to this Yankee squad to have someone with so much emotion. And uh, there's 25 guys in that dugout, and it seems like you have the emotion of everyone in your body. <laughs> well, I, I think uh, sometimes people forget how fun this game is, and and that's why it's I love playing a team sport because when you do well or somebody does well, everyone gets to share it together, and you know that's why baseball it's so much fun because you know when you get a chance to come in the dugout, you know, and share moments like that, and you know you get to make a great play, and everyone gets to high five you, and you get to you know smile your buddy out there. I mean, this game is fun, and it really is. I love it. And, you know, that's why we play. But when you do bad, you're going to be angry, of course. But that's the beauty of this game, those, those ups and downs. But when you have those ups, you've got to have fun with it. The question with this year, first base, you're in the competition, Jason Giambi, Wilson, Betamit, also Morgan Ensberg, who the team brought in. Uh, do you think you have a good shot at, at making the rotation there first? Uh, I have as good a shot as anybody. I'm going to go in there and do my work every day, and I'm going to focus as hard as I can at becoming uh, the best player first base when I can be and at the end of the day if I've earned that job I'm going to go in there and take the same approach every single game play as hard as I can focus as much as I could be and work hard every day I'm not going to stop working and you know it all starts today it's day by day you can't look at the big picture and let it bog you down um, it is competitive but sometimes if you start letting the competitiveness eat you up you you tend to lose your concentration your focus what you should be doing so you know, that sounded complicated, but really I'm just trying to keep it simple and just take it day by day. Baseball is in Duncan's blood. His father, Dave Duncan, is the pitching coach for the St. Louis Cardinals, and his brother, Chris, plays the outfield for the Cardinals as well. And it was that sibling rivalry that kept both Chris and Shelly motivated growing up. Me and Chris are... You know, we'd, we'd start throwing blows after video games, and, you know, we were on the same team growing up, and... We were always, you know, busting our tails trying to be winners, and we we still competitive today. You know, if one guy has a good day, the next guy, the next day, the next guy's trying his butt off to to beat him up. So we're doing that. We're we're competitive still, and sometimes it can get a little harsh, and sometimes it can be bad. But most of all, I think it's I think it's good for us. Now, after you hit that, if you had that multi homer game, did you place a call to your brother just to let him know that you had two home runs in one game? He knew, he knew, but <laughs> the day before he hit one too. So, you know, I had a, I had a home run in a day game and he hit one that night game and he had a couple more hits. So he's rubbing it in my face at night. So <laughs> the next day, the next day we were at it again. And this, this was fun. Now, Eli Manning and Peyton Manning back to back Super Bowl MVP champions. So Archie Manning has to be, his chest has to be swelling with pride. Talk about your father, Dave. He just has to be looking down, you know, looking at this and saying, wow, I got, I got two kids and they're both doing well, and he's got to be proud, proud as heck as, uh, for both you guys. Absolutely. Um, I can't really speak for him, but I do know the happiest moment I can think of in my life was the day I got to tell him I was getting called up and to hear his reaction. You know, his reaction right there gives me goosebumps when I still think about it because, you know, I finally... 
I got to hear and like feel, you know, how important it is to him and what it means to him. That what did he say? <laughs> that's that's a father son conversation right there. But it's the emotion that came out of his voice that was special. Although Duncan may get a bench spot with the Yankees this year, he'll be in the fight of his life when it comes to the battle for first base. Jason Giambi will be there, Wilson Bedemeet will be there, and Morgan Ensberg will also be there as well. But there's one difference between Shelley Duncan and those three players. Shelley Duncan is in camp already and working hard. He's working with Bobby Meacham throwing to second base, and he is poised to make this club to prove that last year's cult hero is here to stay. From George M. Steinbrenner Field, for YesNetwork.com, I'm Chris Sheeran.